Hello everyone and welcome to something different this time. As you can uh, see, I will be starting a let's play of uh, Dust an Illusion Tale. Now, I know a little bit about uh, this game because uh, I already tried to record this earlier, but uh, I had some uh, audio problems uh, myself, so what can you do? So, basically, I played this uh, up in until uh, village part and uh, everything uh, before that I already know. But um, till after that, I would be completely blind of this game. Anyway, let's uh, quickly t check out the uh, settings. I want to make that... Uh, what was uh, it called? Uh, Auto advanced story thing. Yeah, I think... No, no, no. Not, it wasn't here. Was it... Uh, well, uh, I'll figure... I can change it in the game. Let's just start. And... Because I already tried it uh, earlier, I chose a normal back then, but uh, I found it too easy, so I will be taking a tough uh, difficulty this time. Our world has fallen to fade, its great works long since complete, its storied civilizations long since fallen to dust. The greatest legends of Elysium, long since forgotten. What was once a land of promise, has fallen to the ravages of war. And it was in this, our most desperate hour, that the greatest of Elysian tales began. The lone warrior stood against the I really the like this art style here. his way through all who opposed him. The mob stood no chance. And the soldier showed no mercy. But despite his victories, his skills, his ruthlessness, the valiant soldier would perish on this day. Not to the mob, but to a single child. Dust. Dust. Oh. Arise. Apparently I already had changed it. Oh well. What? A talking sword? What are you? Only that which you have summoned. Summoned? How? For what purpose? That I do not know. But we shall learn in time. Now rise and claim the blade of Ara. Ara. Oh. That's a little bit hard to pronounce. Stop! Stop right there! And who is she? Me? I'm Fidget. Guardian of the sword. Yeah, you don't look like guardian to me. No offense, but aren't you a bit, well, small? For a guardian, I mean. Hey, I just look after that thing. After 200 years, nobody expects the sword to just fly off and start, and you know, good point. Talking. I'm kind of wishing somebody told me this was part of the job description. Or maybe they did, and I just wasn't paying attention. Yeah, Seems uh, just her. like her. I'm sorry, I think I misheard before. You said your name was Fidget? Hey, this isn't about me. <laughs> You're the one who's got my sword. How about you tell me your name? I'm... Uh... Calm yourself, Fidget. His name is Dust. And he is the one who woke me from my slumber. So, Fidgets, then? That's me. And you're... Dust? It would yes. seem that way, though I can't recall that name. 
let me guess we will be finding out uh, our character's real name uh, later on uh, in this story. Most likely not, but uh, it could be possible. So, what is this sword? I am the Blade of Ara, and you, Dust, are my fated sword bearer. Yes, well, <laughs> that's all great and everything, but I think it's about time I got this sword back to the claim. I can't let you just leave with this sword fidget. Right now, it's the only thing that knows who I am. I don't even know how I got here. Hmm. Well, then you leave me no choice. I... I challenge you! The winner gets um, the sword! I don't really think you... I want to... beat up her. Well, I... Alright, alright, you win. But don't think I'm leaving empty-handed. I'm coming with you. But, um, <laughs> I really need the sword back when you're done doing, you know, whatever it is you're doing. What exactly am I doing, Ara? The yeah, good question. Lie to the east. There is a path through the glade that leads down the mountainside, and from there you will find a village. That is your first step. Then will you give me the sword? I really need to get it back home before anyone notices it's... <laughs> Gone. I don't know. I, don't, I think uh, what it is I'm supposed to do with it. It's all yours, Fidget. Come on. I think uh, they go. have already noticed it's gone. Let's see if there's anything here. Yes. On my first uh, attempt uh, at this part, I didn't check uh, back there, was there anything over there, but uh, because I already know we are going to see that chest uh, down there, I uh, went and took it. And that's the healing item. I don't want to use uh, these uh, yet because uh, they heal uh, so much and uh, I only got uh, so little health. Hmm. What is it, Fidget? Well, my kind has what you'd call a sixth sense. And there's something just ahead. That comes in handy. Plenty, I assume. Ah, this. Is there anything else over here? Nothing. Let's go. Down here. More food and... Uh, treasure note. Um... Okay. And oh, here's right. that chest. We found a chest. Correction. We found a locked chest. Which well, we have a key for? now. Smash it open. <laughs> that would be unwise, Dust. These chests are protected by arcane locks from the last era and are well beyond my capabilities. I suppose we'll need a key then. Luckily we got one. I like this uh time to bit here interesting way of doing this and I think I'll switch that uh, as my healing item also what else we got it, yes this revival stone That will come in handy, I hope. This is simply beautiful. Ah, Calm yourself, Aww. Bridget. Dust. 
focus. Remember what you've learned thus far. Time to have some fun. <laughs> I still like uh, Fidget uh, being a bit of a fourth wall breaker here. Oh. Yeah, this is much uh, more challenging now. about monsters strange where did I learn these skills you wield the blade of Ara and with it all the skills imbued therein I like uh, this uh, now more because uh, <laughs> on my first playthrough nice? I just uh, felt I didn't uh, power? It is have to do basically have anything and they died for such selfish reasons there is a village beyond these woods Perhaps finding it will aid in restoring your memories. And then we'll be in the clear, right? No more monsters. Fidget. Let's I hope so. Things are about to get a whole lot But uh, I think uh, dust is more correct this here. Started off so well. At least take these feeble fruits. Something tells me you're going to need them. Yeah. And save point. I will be overwriting my first playthrough because, uh, like I said, uh, I kind of wanted uh, this. Uh, I mean, I tried this game, uh, be tried to, to record earlier, but that didn't go so well. So now it's uh, going to be only on that. Ow! That's hurt! That really hurt! Next to screen, some treasure around, but was it that or Hold here, Dust. You have is there anything ability. else? Bear witness to the dust storm. And showing some new skills I here. Like Hold the I like this uh, attack. Form the dust storm, but beware, skilled as you may be, you cannot maintain the storm for long without hurting yourself. In that case, maybe I can help. If you press the super ballistic fidget action button <laughs> power, I'll perform an attack so spectacularly on and, uh, that it'll produce emotions you didn't even know existed. Seems like I Please have some uh, settings uh, wrong here. <gasps> that was, uh, very pretty. Well, maybe I'll just keep the rest of my repertoire to and myself. And that was quite cute. I'm sorry, Fidget. I'm sure it'll come in handy somehow. Cute. I Actually, mean. Dust, between the three of us, this could be quite useful. The Dust Storm can manipulate Fidget's projectile into a more powerful attack. Observe. <laughs> time I use my power, it'll use up a bit of energy meter. You can recharge the meter with melee combos. Yes, Dust. Between your combos and Fidget's own powers, you can achieve a higher hit chain, which will yield bonus experience after each battle. However, 
If you are struck by an enemy, the chain will be broken and you will lose your bonus experience. Alright. We don't want I that to happen. Oops. Sorry. 